And Hollins again. Played nicely into the path of McCready and turning it again for Hudson. Bremner very active, trying to cover all the ways, though. Still with Hudson, trying to curl one. And a fine save by Harvey. But some brilliant work there by Alan Hudson. He waited and he waited and he tried to turn Bremner one way and the other and then he really let one go. And Harvey did well to get a fist to push it away. And another free kick for Chelsea. Maybe another crisis for Harvey because Cook will want to swing this one in. Webb was right in there, Webb in fact got a hit to it! Got in there first with a glancing header. And Les Cocker, the Leeds trainer, still there. In fact, it was Les Cocker who trapped the ball as it went behind, so perilously close to that Leeds goal to Cook. Chelsea playing some good stuff, but fully aware of what a difficult task it always is to break down a Leeds United defence. Webb, and now Hudson, and now Osgood with a chance to hit one. Curling just wide. Quite a deliberate shot there by Osgood, a deliberate curling shot. And the misjudgment was only a slight one. That couldn't have uh, passed more than a foot wide of that Leeds United post. So Leeds at the moment down to ten men with the emergency goalkeeper. And the chance really is wide open now for Chelsea to make something of it. There's Cook going through. And he missed his kick. And a good piece of goalkeeping by Lorimer. All credit to him. A tremendous piece of goalkeeping in the early seconds there from Peter Lorimer. Crowd beginning to rise now as they suspect that Chelsea might find something here. There's Garland who looked as though he was offside and a save and Oscar is in and the goal is given. Oscar has scored, Lorimer is beaten, there was nothing he could do. And if there was the slightest suspicion in the first place that Garland might have been fractionally offside, the referee and the linesman didn't think so. And Lorimer, in fact, saved well from Garland, but he couldn't save the shot from Osgood. And Chelsea, in injury time at the end of the first half, go into the lead. Hudson. The long ball forward, and Cook is onside. The referee's kept his flag down, and Cook has made it number two. The referee kept his flag down, or linesman kept his flag down, as Leeds United looked at him, and Cook was put through. Bremner's having a go at Cherry there for something he failed to do. Cook went storming on his way to put Chelsea 2-0 ahead. Was in trouble once more, and it's with Kemba to Hudson. Forward now for Cook in a little bit of space there. Ellum's come towards him, and Cook's going on. Turn for Osgood, left for Garland, and a simple goal, and well taken. And the crowd stupidly children are doing this goodness only knows they've been allowed to come over the terraces onto the uh, edge of the pitch and now really they're doing Chelsea no by no favors by coming on but a lovely move down the left for Chelsea and a nice dummy there by Osgood and Garland left with the simplest of tasks Bates trying to get a 1-2 going with Johnny Giles and it needed a good interception there. Yorath with a shot and a good save by Bonetti that very nearly crept through for Leeds United. It's with Charlie Cook. Harris. Again one towards the near post. Garland up well! Chris Garland, his second. who made so many good runs down the right crossed it and Garland rose well I think in all honesty a Harvey or a Sprake would have saved it but a Lorimer couldn't now coming to the last seconds of the game rather a wild kick there by Yorath Hudson flicking it on again Osgood trying to get in Garland turned back for Hollins to hit one but before he can hit it with any great effect the whistle had gone for the end of the game and a victory in the first game for Chelsea, but a miserable time for poor old Peter Lorimer and a disastrous time for Leeds United with all the troubles that they had. And then in the end, the goals after the troubles have come, the goals raining down on them. First of all from Osgood, then from Cook, and then two from Chris Garland. So a jubilant Chelsea fans on the pitch and a final scoreline at Stamford Bridge that reads Chelsea 4, Leeds United 0.